I welcome all of you on the platform of your PD education and there is a good news for all those students who are either gate qualified or without gate. So as I told you that uh, the opportunities for students with gate score or without gate score are almost same uh, depending upon you know what kind of opportunities you want to explain, uh, explore through uh, this particular admission processes in various IITs. Now IIT Gandhinagar uh, as we know is one of the unique IIT which uh, provides lot of stipend, very good scholarship and provide lot of opportunities for students who want to join the courses. There is another good thing in IIT Gandhinagar that the kind of research work being done in the labs of IIT Gandhinagar is interdisciplinary. That means a student of computer science can sit in the labs of civil engineering and vice versa and they can take course from any other department so that the learning could be properly enhanced and they get into the best career. So the difference between the branches as you say uh, placement in uh, civil engineering is less than computer science go to IIT Gandhinagar and civil engineer is also sitting in the labs of computer science and you can get similar kind of jobs. IIT Gandhinagar is giving very high scholarships in PhD and MTech. Now my this video is related to early admission in PhD for uh, students with gate score and without gate score. So IIT Gandhinagar has advertised this and this is for IIT, NIT and some select colleges. Either they will provide the list of that select colleges or they are centrally funded technical institutes or top notch uh, colleges in the private domain in all over India. Now let me share with you this information. Uh, start early PhD program and that will start from July 2022 and the dates I think application dates are in the March itself. The good thing here is GATE score is not mandatory for admission that is something which is the uh, latest development uh, in many of the institutes. I mean GATE should not be the only criteria you know they can interview you and keep watching your PDA. Uh, we have interacted with many professor in IIT Gandhinagar in which they are revealing that what they want in students in, in PhD or MS whenever they join. So what do they see in the students in the interview that will be very very relevant for you. And uh, uh, now the scholarship monthly stipend for those with a valid gate score and what is the valid gate score is not very high gate score. Don't think I should have 500, 600, 700 valid gate score that means you are qualified. So if you are qualified in gate for the last maybe 2 to 3 years then you get 41,000 per month. If you do not have gate then you get 31,000 per month and then some more support system is also given. You know team Europedia visited IIT Gandhinagar campus we could uh, get the chance to interact with director and many other professors there and we realized that IIT Gandhinagar is the institute which sends many students during PhD abroad also for even 9 months spending uh, lakhs of rupees on their traveling and everything. So this is a great opportunity actually. Now uh, which student can go? So it is a direct admission. Uh, B.Tech to uh, direct PhD. Students from NIT who will graduate in 2022 and are among top 5 rank holders in their own branches depending upon the category and 10 rank in SCST uh, categories and uh, at the end of you know their uh, pre-final and final year they should have that particular rank. So it is not that third year can join in PhD it is not the meaning of that. This uh, statement simply means that you should be among top 5 rank holders in third year at the end of third year and end of final year that your college department will issue you some kind of certificate for that. BTEC students the CGPA requirement after third and final year is 6. So if you are BTEC from IIT this is your requirement. Now the catch here is some select colleges. Now what those colleges are maybe IIT Gandhinagar will provide you the list for that or uh, that should be really good colleges from where you graduate at par with IITs and NITs. So this is a good opportunity for all the students who are from IIT and NIT and they can pursue good research work in IIT Gandhinagar. Early bird basically program of IIT Gandhinagar and I personally feel that this is a good opportunity you must explore it but yes there will be interview there will be they will have uh, some analysis with you and how to prepare for interview and all. Uh, watch the Europedia video we are going to release very soon in which professors of IIT Gandhinagar are telling what can be the criteria when they what criteria do they focus when they take students for these courses. Thank you.